Pantelleria, the ancient Cossira or Cossura, is an Italian island and commune in the Strait of Sicily in the Mediterranean Sea, 100 km miles southwest of Sicily and 60 km miles east of the Tunisian coast. Tunisia is visible on clear days. Administratively Pantelleria's commune belongs to the Sicilian province of Trapani. With an area of 83 square kilometers, 32 square miles, it is the largest volcanic satellite island of Sicily. The last eruption occurred below sea level in 1891, and today phenomena related to volcanic activity can be observed, such as hot springs and fumaroles. The highest peak called Montagna Grande reaches 836 meters, 2743 feet above sea level. Names The Carthaginians knew the island as Yrnm Punic, or Yrnm Punic. The Greek geographers recorded it as Kossira Greek, Kossira which became the Latin Kossira. This appears in Arabic as Kossira Quesart and Maltese as the former name Kossira. The original Arab name for the island was Bint al-Raya, Bient al-Raya meaning, "...daughter of the winds." after the strong gales that can arise off the north coast of Africa. Its Sicilian name is Pantadiria, which gave rise to the present Maltese name Pantelleria. History Archaeological exploration has unearthed dwellings and artifacts 35,000 years old. The original population of Pantelleria did not come from Sicily, but were of Iberian or Ibero Ligurian stock. After a considerable interval, during which the island probably remained uninhabited, the Carthaginians took possession of it, no doubt owing to its importance as a station on the way to Sicily. This probably occurred around the beginning of the 7th century BC. Their acropolis was the twin hill of San Marco and Santa Teresa, 2 kilometres south of the present town of Pantelleria. The town has considerable remains of walls made of rectangular blocks of masonry and also of a number of cisterns. Punic tombs have been discovered, and the votive terra cottas of a small sanctuary of the Punic period were found near the north coast. The Romans occupied the island as the Fasti Triumphales record in 255 BC, lost it again the next year, and recovered it in 217 BC. It struck bronze coins, originally with a Punic inscription but changing to Latin by the 1st century BC. Under the Empire, it served as a place of banishment for prominent persons and members of the imperial family. The town enjoyed municipal rights. In AD 700, Arabs conquered the island. In 1123, Roger II of Sicily took the island, and in 1311 an Aragonese fleet under the command of Luis de Requesens won a considerable victory here. Requesens's family became princes of Pantelleria until 1553, when the Turks captured the island. A naval battle took place near the island in July 1586 when an armed English merchant fleet of five ships managed to repel an attack by eleven Spanish and Maltese galleys. A Siculo Arabic dialect similar to Maltese was the vernacular of the island until the late 18th century, when the Romance Sicilian superseded it. The modern Sicilian language in Pantelleria contains many Arabic loanwords, and most of the island's place names are of Semitic origin. During the Napoleonic Wars, the British considered the possibility of taking over Pantelleria together with Lampedusa and Lanosa so as to be able to supply Malta, but a royal commission stated in an 1812 report that there would be considerable difficulties in this venture. Pantelleria's capture was regarded as crucial to Operation Husky. The Allied invasion of Sicily in 1943 as planes based on Pantelleria could readily reach Sicily. In Operation Corkscrew the Allies bombarded Pantelleria heavily from air and sea in the days before the invasion. The garrison surrendered as the landing troops approached. Pantelleria then became a vital base for Allied aircraft during the assault on Sicily. Geology <laughs> <laughs> The island of Pantelleria is located above a drowned continental rift in the Strait of Sicily and has been the focus of intensive volcano tectonic activity. The 15-kilometre-long island is the emergent summit of a largely submarine edifice. 
Two large Pleistocene calderas dominate the island, the older of the two formed about 114,000 years ago and the younger Cinque Denti caldera formed about 45,000 years ago. The eruption that formed the Cinque Denti caldera produced the distinctive green tuff deposit that covers much of the island, and is found across the Mediterranean, as far away as the island of Lesbos in the Aegean. Holocene eruptions have constructed pumice cones, lava domes, and short, blocky lava flows. Post Green Tuff activity constructed the cone of Monte Gabele, part of which was subsequently uplifted to form Montaña Grande. Several vents are located on three sides of the uplifted Montaña Grande block on the southeast side of the island. A submarine eruption in 1891 from a vent off the northwest coast is the only confirmed historical activity. Currently, the island is subsiding, and Montaña Grande is slowly sinking. This is thought to be caused by the magma beneath the volcano cooling and degassing. There are numerous hot springs and fumaroles on the island due to an active hydrothermal system. Favara Grande, in the southeast of the island, is one of the best examples. The island is releasing a small amount of CO2 through passive degassing. Total carbon stock in the first 30 cm of soil of Pantelleria is about 230,000 megagrams. The island is the type locality for peralkaline rhyolitic rocks, pantellerites. Climate Main sites Natural areas A large nature reserve is on the island, and a natural lake, called Specchio di Venere it formed in an extinct volcanic crater, and is fed by rain and hot springs. The lake is 12 meters 39 feet deep and is popular for swimming, hot springs, and mud bathing. Other natural attractions are paths to the sea, a large network of trekking paths, hot springs, and a popular natural sauna fed by vapors filtering through rocks in a small cave. Archaeological sites. A Middle Bronze Age village was on the west coast, 3 km miles southeast of the harbour, with a rampart of small blocks of lava, about 7.5 metres 25 feet high, 10 metres 33 feet wide at the base and 5 metres 16 feet at the top, upon the undefended eastern side. Remains of huts were found there, with pottery, tools of obsidian, and other artefacts. These objects are in the museum at Syracuse. To the southeast, in the district known as the Cunelli, are many tombs, known as Sesi. They are similar in character to the Nurag of Sardinia, though of smaller size, and consist of round or elliptical towers with sepulchral chambers in them, built of rough blocks of lava. Fifty-seven of them can still be traced. The largest is an ellipse of about 18 by 20 meters 59 by 66 feet, but most of the Sesi have a diameter of only 6 to 7 meters 20 to 23 feet. The identical character of the pottery found in the Sesi with that found in the prehistoric village proves that the former are the tombs of the inhabitants of the latter. <laughs> Monuments and other buildings The island has scattered typical one-level buildings called damuso of unknown but probably remote origins. A damuso is a dry stone building with thick walls that usually appear black due to the extensive use of volcanic rock. They have characteristic domes on top painted white to avoid overheating. The domes collect rainwater that is directed to a large tank usually below the building or to the nearby soil for use in the dry season. Most of the other constructions were destroyed during the Second World War. One notable exception is the Castle Barbicane, a Renaissance building formed by an irregularly quadrangular plan with internal court joined to a squared base tower. <laughs> Wine Pantelleria is noted for its sweet wines, Moscato di Pantelleria and Moscato Passito di Pantelleria, both made from the local Zabibbo grape. 
In 2014, the traditional agricultural practice of cultivating the Vite ad Alberello head trained bush vines of the community of Pantelleria was inscribed on the representative list of the Intangible Cultural Heritage of Humanity of UNESCO. C. 1. Transport The island is served by Pantelleria Airport, which is served by Alitalia, connecting Trapani and Palermo and other companies in summer, connecting the island with Italian cities such as Milan, Rome, Venice and others. Ferries reach the island from Trapani, and it is near the main east-west route through the Mediterranean. See also. List of islands of Italy List of volcanoes in Italy Italy–Tunisia delimitation agreement <inaudible>